No lawyer? I don't need a lawyer, dude. I'm my lawyer right here. What'd you say about me? What, uh, what did box. I do? You said, come over here, Coop. Yeah, I'm right here. You got something Good to say, Dennis? Good luck in your case, sir. Of course I got something to say. Anybody who wants to be uh, my attorney, raise your hand. No. Nope. Oh. I normally would. So I would probably crush Splainer in two seconds. He'd be like, can't. he'd be like climbing Mount Everest without an oxygen tank. That's I feel like that'd be you. fun to watch. Now is there a um, good luck though? You got this. So my we believe in you. So I so I I got banned oh. off of, off of Fiverr. Uh, I can't hire anybody from Fiverr. Uh, do you guys got a lawyer? <laughs> you from oh. Damn. Damn. There's been a lot of those going around people. lately. Yeah. All right. Fiverr. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> good sight. Yeah, they banned me because yeah. I, I charged back somebody. Oh my God. <laughs> you hate Did to you see try it. it. Hate to see. Did you try the yellow pages? It might we might find I don't know. Ooh, here right. comes here comes the judge. Uh oh. All right, Good luck. Tried. Remember the deal you made. Maybe he Wait, could try like yep. talk. Well, if I get if I if, if I'm found guilty of something, uh, I can't get my license back for car. Two days. Right. <gasps> no crimes. Yep. Oh. What? That's the deal we made with Bud. Damn. Yeah. I almost fell over too. Wait, is this the next next in the suitcase? Here we go, everybody. Everybody to where they need to be at this time, please and thank you. Uh, where is your counsel, uh, Mr. Paul? Now, it appears to me, Your Honor, that nobody in the city is qualified to represent me. I'm the best fit to represent myself, so that's what I'm going to do today. Thank you, Your Honor. Uh, that is your right. You so choose to represent yourself. Okay. Um, I would suggest, though, Mr. Paul, that you find someone who's going to represent you. Um, it takes a long hey, time to be able to... Your Honor? Your Honor? Conduct Your Honor? yourself as a lawyer. Go ahead. Your Honor, I have done nothing wrong, and all I have to do here today is tell the truth, and nobody is more qualified to tell the truth than the person who was in the middle of it. That, that's all, Your Honor. Okay, thank you. Um, then we'll go ahead and we'll begin this case. Give me a moment to find the papers regarding yeah, this case. Madam Mayor. Oh, yeah, we are. Yeah. We're going to take his casino. Has anyone been punched yet? No, but we could probably erase that. Make sure you give Coop the bingo card. Oh, yeah, yeah. You want the bingo card? This is paperwork. What? Showing up. Gotcha. Bingo cards have been sent. Was he late coming in here? Andy, I think you already have a bingo card. So you should be fine. Come off, get a minute. No, he actually wasn't. <laughs> Word, however, that's got to be from Arts. <laughs> All the okay. Last minute I need to put me uh, out So, uh, we have the case of Jack Frent versus Jean Paul. A statement of claim is going to read as follows On or around February 26, 2020, uh, 2021, Jean Paul stole a Department of Corrections vehicle and drove it into the ocean, causing significant damage to the vehicle. He then took pictures of the sunk vehicle and posted them on Twitter to brag of his efforts against law enforcement officers. Compensatory, compensatory damages are sought out today. It's going to be $2,277 in repair cost of the damages done to the Department of Corrections. That's vehicle. it. The punitive damages seeking therein is going to be $7,723. For a grand total of ten thousand uh, dollars. With Wait, that what? being said, we're gonna have opening statements from the plaintiff, and then we'll have an opening statement from the defense. Uh, Mr. Splainer, I assume you are gonna be delivering opening statement, or will it be uh, Tim Collins? 
I'll be deferring to Tim Collins for opening statements. Tim Collins, please give us opening Thanks. statement at this time. Thank you, Your Honor, and may it please the court. The second restatement of torts defines trespass to chattels as intentionally dispossessing another of a chattel or using or intermeddling with the chattel in the possession of another. The restatement further states that harm to personal property or diminishment of its quality, condition, or value as a result of a defendant's use can also result in liability. We intend to show today that the defendant intentionally intermeddled and interfered in the personal property. Objection. Of Objection on the floor. What is it? Uh, speculation. Uh, overruled. Please continue. Uh, we intend to show today that the defendant intentionally intermeddled and inter interfered in the personal property of the plaintiff, specifically by illegally obtaining possession of the plaintiff's vehicle, driving it off the Del Perro Pier, photographing his exploits, and bragging about them on Twitter. At the conclusion of the evidence presented today, we ask this court to define the defendant accountable for his actions and to award damages to compensate Mr. Frent for the damage that he suffered to his property. Wasn't thank me. you, Your Honor. All right, thank you. Um, now we will have opening statements from the defense. Do you have anything you wish to open up with, uh, Mr. Jean Paul? Uh, yes. Uh, before I make my, make my statement, I would like to have a sort of precision. Uh, what is a, 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 a chattel? Or well, whatever you said. Uh, he, uh, at the beginning of statement, you this made. This is he, why. He this said is that. Why, this is why we have uh, attorneys, Mr. John Paul. Now, if you would please give your opening statement, uh, that would be very good. Okay. Uh, I'm going to walk to the stand for this because uh, I want to speak loud so everybody knows what's going on. Yep. Go ahead. Please and thank you. Hello, sir. Uh, hello, everybody. Opposition. Judges, witnesses. Hey. Now, um, today, today's queries will be very, very short because uh, I am innocent of uh, all crimes being um, pursued against me. Uh, now, I would like to make this clear that uh, I did not throw any cars in the ocean on that day and that the picture that was posted on Twitter was not mine. Uh, ever since I've come here and I've, I've immigrated, I've had no friends, no connections, and I was just trying to get some street cred. So I picked up the picture of somebody else and I posted on Twitter, trying to claim the credit. That's all, Your Honor. Thank you, Mr. John Paul. Um, I will remind you, John Paul, that this is a civil suit. We are not accusing you of crimes. Uh, this is to figure out whether or not you will be held responsible for damages that were caused on that day. <clears throat> as much as uh, you are right, Your Honor, uh, I truly believe that if this case uh, goes guilty or I lose the case, this will be used as a um, as evidence or will be used against me. Uh, if another suit is uh, brought up uh, from the police to me, a, cr uh, a criminal. Um, Mr. John Paul, uh, this happened uh, um, more than 30 days ago. I assure you the police will not be bringing charges to you because the statute of limitations has been passed. God damn straight, pal. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you Your Honor. Okay, thank you. Yep. Uh, your first witness, uh, plaintiff. Uh, I, I guess we'll call Mr. Jean Paul up there and get this out of the way first. Mr. Jean Paul, uh, over here to the right, to my right. There we go. Thank you, <clears throat> Bailiff. When he's able to sit down, please swear him in. All righty, Mr. Paul. When you're ready, raise your left hand for me. Also, Mr. Jean Paul, um, your selection and suit, the the lines. And the plaid jacket, I hate to clash very hard. If you need help dressing yourself, please contact me after this case. Um, <clears throat> We're swimming. Uh, Go ahead. All right. All righty, Mr. Paul. Do you swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth under the penalty of perjury? So help you, Mitch. I swear. Praise uh, Mitch. Praise Mitch. Praise, Praise Mitch. Praise Mitch. Amen. Bless Amen. You, Amen. Uh, may I proceed, Your Honor? Uh, you may proceed with your questioning. Okay. Uh, can you state your uh, full name for the court's record just to get us started? My full name legally is Jean Paul. 
Alrighty, Mr. Jean Paul. No, uh, reference. Um, sir, I would like to be addressed as Jean Paul. Jean Paul. Jean Paul. Yes. Is that a is that is that appropriate enough for you, Jean Paul? Yes, that's my full name. Fantastic. Alrighty, Mr. Jean Paul. Uh, referencing the plaintiff's B, is that a Twitter post from your Twitter account? Yes. Okay. Uh, why did you make this uh, post on Twitter? Um. Now, I, I work at Burger Shot, which is near the pier, and uh, we, um, we serve sometimes uh, the homeless, the people in need, and then sometimes, coincidentally, we serve uh, criminals, and they, uh, they hold uh, discussion circles in the premises, and I overheard them uh, throwing vehicles in the ocean and taking pictures, and uh, I thought I, I would look cool to the other uh, people in town if I t took such a picture and posted it myself on Twitter claiming the credit for it. Over. Okay, uh, when did you start working at the burger shop? I started working about, I would say, two, three weeks into my introduction um, to the city from uh, my country of residence. Um, I would say a month ago. Okay, could you give us a specific date that you were hired in the burger shop? Uh, not precisely, I don't recall, Your Honor, sorry. Okay, I'm just a lawyer. You don't have to refer to me as uh, as your honor, but I appreciate the, the sentiment. Sure. Uh, let's see here. Um, so, what is the what is the kraken of retribution? Um, it's just it's just um, it's just a story that I read when I was a kid. Over. Okay. Uh, and when you said in that uh, Twatter post that uh, one car at a time, was was this the first car that you had dumped into the ocean? Um, I, I, I don't recall. Sorry. Okay, so you don't know how many cars you've dumped into the ocean? Oh, no. I mean, I, I didn't dump that one, but um, I don't know about other ones. Okay. Um. Did you uh, air quotes feed the plaintiff's car to the air quotes Kraken? Sorry, is this, uh, is this, what are we talking about here? The Kraken, was that on the Twitter post? Yes, the, the Kraken of Retribution was on the Twitter post. And I just wanted to, because you had referenced the Kraken of Retribution as it is directly quoted. I wanted to know if you had uh, fed the plaintiff's car to the Kraken. Oh, uh, no, sir. The Kraken is no such thing. And, um... I, I believe that you're letting your imagination uh, run wild with this one. Over. Okay. Uh, if that is your personal belief, then that is just fine. Um, did you create the hashtag uh, let them know? Yes, sir. But w what is the hashtag let them know? Um, is, is that a movement or a handle of some kind? Now, let them know is, a, is just a way of life. Letting them know is doing things that matter, doing things that I care about, that you should care about and letting the people know that it happened so they know so they can they can themselves be part of things that matter and propel their lives for further success okay so this uh this hashtag had been uh, put on to uh, the twitter post to, to let them know that you had fed a card of the kraken yes sir all righty now uh, i would like here. i would like to state nope that's all i needed thank you sir Alrighty. Um, I don't know if I have any further questions for this witness. I would turn over to my co-counsel if uh, I would turn over to my co-counsel if, no, if he has any questions. I don't have any questions, Your Honor. Okay. Okay. Um, seeing that there's no counsel, you may step down. Uh, uh, can I can I question myself? You know what? Sure. Go for it. Okay. <clears throat> I'd like to begin by uh, saying. That, no, um, a quick, no, it's got to be a question. So what you need okay. to do yeah, I got is it. you need I got to uh, go to the podium right yep. here in front yep. of me, ask a question, it. and then come back. Now, Mr. Jean-Paul, the, the hashtag that um, plaintiff has uh, stated, let him, let him know, whatever that is, right? Have you only used this when throwing cars into the ocean, the OC, or any other car? Um, uh, no, sir. Uh, the hashtag let them know 
if if you would like to look at, at the total records, has been posted over uh, hundreds, if not thousands, of times. Objection. Facts are not in evidence. It's going to be uh, sustained. Thank uh, you. It's going to be that that the last part of your answer is going to be uh, scratched from the record, but continue on. Uh, the hashtag let them know isn't uh, exclusive to things uh, that are um, bad or bad uh, per, per se, per what he says. Uh, I, I've used this in uh, promotional purposes. I've used this when I was hired in the first place, when I was fired. I used it um, when I was found of, uh, uh, when I won the case for the, 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 the state, I've twatted let them know. And also I have twatted it when I won a Frygate. The case about fraud. Now, uh, so Mr. Jean-Paul, uh, on the night that um, all of what they claimed happened, uh, where were you? Um, uh, on the night that uh, the, that they that everything happened. I was working tirelessly at Burger Shot, making minimum wage, just trying to make a living. It, it, it's been a tough time, but uh, I, I've been pulling through trying to turn a new leaf and become an, uh, an upstanding citizen. Right. Thank you, Mr. Jean-Paul. No more questions. No more questions, Your Honor. Over. Right. Thank you. Uh, I do have some questions on redirection. Oh, uh, Mr. John Paul, you need to come back up here for a redirect. Alrighty, uh, Mr. John Paul, you said that you had to turn over a new leaf. What was what was the previous leaf? What was your previous direction in life? Now, if you have. Uh, <clears throat> My, the previous leaf was a leaf of mistakes, misunderstanding, ignorance, failures, and mishaps. And I want to turn all this behind me and move on to something better, something greater. I want to be an upstanding citizen that does good for others, succeeds, and help turn a profit for everybody. Okay, uh, what were some of these uh, previous uh, mistakes as you called them? What, what were the nature of these mistakes? The mistake that amounted to uh, 133 points on my license, me going to jail multiple times, including a, a case of a prostitution. Uh, but all of this is behind me now. Okay. Uh, have you ever had any charges pressed uh, against you for uh, feeding police cars to the Kraken? No. Okay. Uh, the plaintiff would uh, reference police report 2298, in which Mr. Uh, Jean Paul has faced charges concerning this criminal uh, action. And that was the charge of grand theft. Objection! Auto. Uh, Speculation. Objection on that. Let me see if I can find the report. Sir, the, report the, pla the, pla the plaintiff is uh, putting words in my mouth and he's declaring intentions and uh, 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 made up context on a, uh, a charge for me being a. Uh, Going to jail. Your Honor, this was uh, filed as the plaintiff's see it as material fact to this case. Well, I mean, that's going to be the wrong objection, but um, you're going to be overruled. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor. Okay, he, he so can't say it was uh, a referencing uh, police report uh, 2298, are, uh, are you the Mr. Jean Paul that was uh, charged in this report? Yes. So you have faced charges for throwing, uh, for for feeding the kraken. With Objection. Uh, once again, uh, whatever the sir, what was the objections um, as a successful outcome a reason? What was your question again, the explainer? Uh, so I was re-asking the question in light of police report uh, two two nine eight of whether he has. Uh, I was saying that this uh, police report is where he faced criminal charges for feeding the Kraken with a police car, correct? Uh, that was going to be the full question, but it was interrupted. Okay. Um, sir, sir, objection, conjecture, um, based on a, on a report of, let's say, uh, damaging uh, uh, property from the government, uh, he, he can't add a random motive like the Kraken to it if it was not admitted into the case or into the report itself. Well, 
look at Mayor about your honor? Oh, you may. Go ahead. Uh, the Kraken was specifically stated within the twat. Twat is cited as evidence within the police report. There's no founding to the objection. Um, uh, sir, um, tw um, Twatter, SoundCloud, uh, YouTube are all platforms of social media, and they're also considered art and entertainment. Uh, I believe that entertaining the public uh, shouldn't be a crime, and, and, and me putting words like uh, if it was on a rap song or uh, on a piece of art, such as the, the picture taken, uh, shouldn't be used in, against me in the court of law. I'm going to overrule. I'm going to see where this goes. Okay. Uh, so uh, you were uh, you were hit with criminal charges of Grand Theft Auto and uh, concern of feeding a police car to the Kraken uh, in this police report 2298, correct? Uh, yeah. I would I would really appreciate if you stopped saying the Kraken and just uh, stay, uh, went on the facts themselves only. Uh, I'm going to object to that as non-responsive, regardless of the witness's personal feelings to my questions. Uh, if he wishes to uh, have his attorney object to my conjectures, then that would be welcome. So the question needs to stop having the Kraken in it. That That is, uh, he, he can't prove that that's the motive. Uh, if, if, you want to stay, if you want to stay on the facts, I'm, I'm willing to, but that's just, that's just, yeah, that's crazy. Uh, objection is going to be sustained on the plaintiff's side, okay? Um, please answer the question, Mr. John Paul. Could you repeat the question one last time, please? Okay. Uh, have you faced charges for uh, feeding a police car to the Kraken as reference to police report 2298 that's been submitted into the evidence as the plaintiff's C? I have been found guilty of damaging or vandalizing uh, government property, such as cars in the past, by uh, possibly driving them in the ocean. Yes. Okay. Uh, did you attempt to appeal these charges? No. Why not? Because I was found guilty of them. Uh, so were you found guilty of these at a bench trial? No, I just, I, I didn't appeal. I just, um, uh, I pled guilty to these charges because they were true. Oh, so you're admitting that uh, everything within this police report is true and that's why you pled guilty? Oh. I fed, uh, I didn't, and it, I, I fed the car into the ocean. Oh. Okay, uh, was it the, the police Audible car gasp. that's, uh, is sir? it the police car that's alleged in this report? No, sir, that would be a DOC car, which is completely different. And on top of that, um, I'm currently under oath and uh, I, I'm not going to lie. Now, the, the, the police report was true. And I, if, 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 if it was a lie, I would have went to bench trial for it. But instead I pled guilty. Okay. Uh, with that, I don't have any further questions for this witness. Uh, I have, uh, oh. Your Honor, uh, I have a few questions for the same witness, Mr. Jean-Paul. No, well, you can, uh, come up and give your side of the story when we switch over to you. Um, do you have any more witnesses plaintiff? Uh, uh, yes, John, the plaintiff John, John, would... Just go back. Just go back. Go, go on back. Go back to your spot. It's going to be your turn in a little bit, John. Just be patient, brother. Just the, take it easy. The, the plaintiff would uh, summon Jack Frent to the stand. Uh-oh. Right, Did he Frent, see anything? Come on, come on up. Yeah, John, you're going to have your chance to speak uh, here in a bit, okay? We'll no problem, Your Honor. All right. Look at all those lawyers sitting over there, too. Ooh. They, right, they, have any, Frent, they did not have any uh, witnesses. This is this you is swear a witness. to tell the truth, the whole truth. They have no witnesses. Nothing Zero. But the truth under the penalty of perjury. So I got this. Image. I do. Right, he's been so sworn I in. Put my paycheck back in. All right. Uh, questions. Go ahead. Plaintiff. Thank you, Your Honor. Uh, to get this started, uh, I can you the your full name and occupation for not the court the record? My name is Jack Frent. I'm a senior correctional officer with the Department of Corrections. Okay, and uh, were you on duty in that capacity uh, on the 26th of February? Uh, yes, I was. Okay, were you in possession of a Department of Corrections issued uh, Crown Victoria Police Interceptor on that date? Yes, I was. Okay, was that uh, was that vehicle ever stolen from you? Uh, it was uh, when it was outside. We came out from City Hall, and it was no longer there. Then okay, the roof. Do you know Zero. who stole it? I win. Uh, based on the twat that was placed later, a little bit later on. I win. It's, I, I actually Hall, win. Uh, also known as X, uh, he has no idea. Has twatted that he threw it into the ocean. 
Okay, and when you're uh, referencing a twat post, are you referencing uh, the plaintiff's B? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, based on uh, the light of those uh, of that twat post, uh, do you know what happened to the vehicle? Uh, so, based on that, it was driven into the ocean and fed to what is known as, I guess, the Kraken. Um, uh, we waited until a little bit after, and we had to have someone from the city basically fish it out of the water for us so we could get it repaired. Okay. Uh, did the tweet imply that this isn't the first government vehicle that uh, Jean-Paul has fed to the Kraken? Uh, based on the twat, uh, it is not. Okay. Uh, did you have to pay for repairs of this uh, CVPI? Uh, yes, I did, out of my own personal pocket. Okay. Fine. The, uh, the plaintiff at this time would reference the plaintiff's A, uh, where that is a uh, repair invoice paid to a mechanic uh, from Jack Friend where uh, this Crown Victoria had to be paid for the substantial damage all that it received from, from being dunked into the ocean. This is all useless. Okay. Uh, do you recall how much you paid for these repairs? Uh, 2,277. <laughs> Objection. Irrelevance, yo. May I rebut to uh, that, Your Honor? I, I will allow a rebuttal. Go ahead. Uh, the entirety of this claim is based upon the, uh, the, the compensatory claim uh, that John Paul caused a damage to a Department of Corrections That's vehicle, the title of the case, though. We uh, already based noticed. on the fact that he uh, dunked it into the ocean. So the amount of uh, money spent repairing that vehicle uh, is absolutely relevant to the case at hand. Overruled, Mr. Paul. I mean, this only matters if he wins. We're not there yet. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's just the objection. Your objection for relevance was overruled. The question that was asked shall now be answered. There's no declaring winners or losers yet. We're still in the proceedings, Mr. Paul. I should up. Stay patient, brother. Uh, do you want me to restate my answer? Or... Uh, sure, go ahead and restate your answer just to get us back on track. I'm telling you I'm winning this. It was, uh, I paid $2,277 in repair. Okay. Um, I don't believe I have any further questions for this witness. Now, see what kind of pressure cooker you right. Oh, I'm going to cut his... Um, I will clap this guy. If you would like to cross-examine the witness, uh, yeah, damn witness straight, there. I would like your honor. Right. Hit him with the lightning. I like that energy. Okay. Um, witness, uh, what is your first and last name, please? Uh, Jack Friend. Jack Friend. Now, Jack Friend, you are the owner of said vehicle, correct? Yeah. Uh, it is a Department of Corrections issued vehicle that we pay out of pocket to repair. Now, before the car disappeared, what, where was the last place that you've seen such vehicle? Uh, it was on the east side parked right out here of the city hall while we were on duty here at city. Now, did you see any individual enter the vehicle or uh, start the vehicle or take off in said vehicle? Uh, no, I did not. Objection compound. Okay. I mean... um, Mr. Paul, ask a question one at a time, one question at a time. Uh, sustained. Ask the first question. Thank you, Your Honor. That's like, that's Did you visually see anybody take off in said vehicle? No, I did not. Perfect. Like now, did you see the car go in the ocean said DOC vehicle? No, I did not. When you claim that you uh, fished the vehicle out of the ocean, when you were um, at the lo current location of the vehicle, did you see any individual near the vehicle? No. Okay. Now I'm gonna move on to my segment two, which is uh, context and frame. Um, what? This is gonna be another set of questions. Uh, first, like have you have you ever listened to uh, music on YouTube? Objection, relevance. Uh, sir, yeah. uh, your, your, your Honor, um, uh, uh, the framing here is to set the picture of entertainment and arts, and uh, I want to know if if, if the if the plaintiff's uh, witness um, has ever experienced art before uh, from a media platform. Right. Uh, I, I'm going to be. 
more inclined to sustain that objection as to um I can rephrase was, I can rephrase No, it's not even about rephrasing. It's the the fact that there was nothing in the direct line of questioning stating or referencing any kind of music or, okay. or anything like that. Please keep your questions to within the scope that has been laid um in the direct line of questioning by the plaintiff. Fair enough. Ask questions enough. pertaining to what had happened okay, within their line of questions. Oh, sorry. Do you use Twatter? Uh, yes, I do. Do you regularly post pictures or uh, statements on Twatter? No, I don't. Since you use it uh, sometimes, like you said, um, have you sometimes uh, posted a joke or something funny or humorous on Twitter? Uh, I I do not typically post on Twitter. No. Okay. Um. Okay. What well, I mean? Wait, didn't he find my picture on Twitter? So did, did you not see my picture on Twitter about about your car? Uh, yes, I did see your picture on Twitter. I do see Twitter. Okay, thank I don't you. Post on. Thank, thank you. No more. No more. Now, in said picture, is there any uh, individual uh, in the picture? No, there is not. Now, is there any proof that any individual were in the vehicle at the time? Hmm? No. Okay. And then that's all, Your Honor. Right. So uh, I have no desire to redirect. Okay. Oh, you may step down, Mr. Friend. Do you have any more witnesses from the plaintiff's side? Uh, no, Your Honor. Just the the fact that the plaintiffs A, B, and C are material items submitted into evidence. The uh, plaintiff rests at this time. Okay. Now we'll switch over to the defense. Um, I will allow you, Mr. Paul, to go ahead and give a recollection of events that happened on that day. You can Me? come up here and actually just speak. Yeah. Our uh, recollection of uh, the events? Yep. Just tell me what happened. Uh, now, um, I would like to say that I did not uh, drive the, the said car or drove in the ocean, but since that was put into since that was that was put into question, I would like to talk more about the Twitter post. Now, the picture wasn't mine. I don't think there's any proof that I took the picture. The picture wasn't even on my phone and still isn't on my phone to this day. And I can submit my phone into evidence if uh, required. Um, Not necessary, but go ahead, continue. Uh, I thought I was making a funny joke out of a picture that would get me a street cred with the boys. And I would appear uh, tough and I would appear as if I do crime. So I would uh, gain respect from my peers down in the south, the GSF, the Ballas and the Vegas, you know what I'm saying? Now then, even though that's pretty bad, it would be, be considered a crime to do a joke like that on Twitter. Um, I think that it isn't, and any, any form of uh, humor or entertainment uh, should be accepted because that's what the platforms were made in the first place. Your Honor. I'm listening, go ahead. Now, there's no, there's no proof of me entering, driving, jumping, or feeding anything into anything. All that there is is a picture on Twitter that we can't even prove was sent from, uh, was taken from my phone. Now, if anybody twatted the same thing or even retwatted, would that not make them as guilty as I am? Uh, I think so. Now, I think these guys are fabricating something based on a past and later evidence to fit their case. I think it's a dangerous, unfair, and disgusting narrative. And I will be found uh, innocent. 
And that's it. No more questions, no more statements, Your Honor. All right, thank you, uh, Mr. Mr. Jean Paul. Uh, I do have some questions for Cross. Oh, if you uh, go ahead and stay up there, uh, a couple questions being asked by the defense. Okay, uh, Mr. Uh, Jean Paul, uh, yep. where did you get this picture if it's not yours? I found it on a uh, third party website. Okay, uh, what is this third party website? Um, uh, an anonymous uh, posting board. Okay, does it have a name? Oh, uh, yeah. Um, Google Images. Google Images. Interesting. Okay. Uh, based on your previous testimony and my own direct line of questioning, uh, when accused of Grand Theft Auto, why did you plead guilty? Uh, which case, sorry? Uh, the previous line of questioning when I referenced uh, Police Report 2298, you said that you had pled guilty to the charge of Grand Theft Auto. Why did you plead guilty to it? Uh, because I was guilty. Okay. Do you know what Grand Theft Auto is? Uh, online video game, sometimes single player. When it comes to a criminal penal code, such mm, as mm, the one entered mm. into the state of San Andreas, do you know what Grand Theft Auto means? Uh, no, sir. Okay. Um, and I just want to confirm, get it on the record, in your previous testimony, you said you pled guilty to the charges in police report 2298 because you committed those crimes, correct? Yes. Okay, uh, I have no further questions well, for this uh, witness. Well, can I, can I say something? Nope, nope, that's all I needed. Thank you, Mr. That, Paula. That's all he, now, now, you may say something after that line of questioning, yes. Well, I would just like to state that um, the, the uh, when I was in jail, when they said a Grand Theft Auto, I thought auto meant automobile, and a theft meant stealing, and I just put them two and two together, a stealing vehicle, and I just said, guilty, motherfucker. And I said it, uh, but it. it's it's in the case uh, that they've written down. Uh, they have a statement. It said it says guilty, motherfucker. Just like yeah, over. Thank you, Mr. Paul. You may go and take your spot at your position. Thank you. I had it, yeah, but I can't I can't lie to oath them. They they will prove that I was guilty of that. All and right. I pled guilty, and it's going to rule me uh, over. Well, all that why being said, there? we are at the closing statement. Do we need to take a moment to uh, gather our thoughts and allow for a closing statement? Just not if, that if, we could, if we could have just five minutes, Your Honor. Yeah, five minutes recess. Thank you, Your Honor. He, he almost had him. He almost did. Hey, you know what, though? Bro, I, I, he's, hey, he, he, look, he, can I say something? What? Like, and, and, and I'm very sincere here. You've done better than some attorneys I've actually seen in this court. Yeah, not bad. Seriously. And I'm not, I'm not mm -hmm. kidding. Oh, thanks, right? guys. The way you projected yourself, the way you spoke, with enthusiasm and... Uh, the passion. The passion. Like, I we like believe it. it. I, we're seeing it. We're energized. Like it. It's interested. It's not just... And I'm being very serious. I'm not yeah. joking with you. Thank you, guys. I've done this a long time, mm. okay? Oh, thank you, thank you. Same. Same. But All right. between you and I, you fucked up on the stand hard, man. Yeah, oh, I yeah, know. You're paying money. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But... Mm. Oh yeah, you owe money. I do appreciate you, uh, you know, stepping up there and hey, god damn, that was good. You know what they said though, right? That was good. Practice makes perfect. Can we come a bar no. license? No. Uh, Mr. Damn. Paul, how's the 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 pilot license been going? Yeah, how's that going uh, for you? I I I reimbursed all the money that it took me to buy the license itself, so I'm and now I'm I'm paid for. Oh, nice. Good, what good kind? Of, what do you have you? Done any flights or anything? Or yep, I've done. You a, gotta let Reggie buy. I've done tours. Uh, so yeah. what? I, what I do is that I pick up um, uh, a, a new migrants to the city, yeah. and uh -huh. they they yeah, get a, yeah. they get a bonus and, uh, to come to the city, right? Uh, when they uh, yeah, uh, like like a city welcome bonus, and uh, I take a small portion of that and I run them all across the island, showing them all the interesting points, all the possible jobs Ooh. and things that they can do. Ooh, and See? like a. Focus on that instead there of criminal you go. activity. There you go. I don't like that. I'd go on that. See? Yeah. Miss Polk, and, and I'll you for a and second. Like, and like we said, yep. we're being very serious here. Yeah. I've seen lawyers come in here and fall flat on their face. You took it on the chin, all right, and kept going. Cool, man. And they, these are people that we've done. We've run multiple law schools. Hell, I, I train junior attorneys in the junior attorney program. So we're saying you did good. Like, uh, we mean that. A lot of them, they get, they clam up. You know, they, yeah. they, they, they get quiet. They get nervous in front of an audience, right? 
and it takes a lot to stand mm -hmm. up in front of people and talk. Mm -hmm. It really does. It does. Thank you, guys. All right, well, I'm going to go talk to this gentleman and wait for the closing uh, statement sure. and verdict. Yeah. Stay out of trouble. No crime. You know how much they're trying to charge you? Are you guys? whispering yeah. at the moment? Yeah, I'm whispering. It's not a criminal. It's not a criminal right. court. What I want you to talk about in your closing is in the police report, it references a cop car. No. It does not ever reference a DOC car other than the picture. Do All right. Like you said, the picture isn't yours and you just tweeted about it. Yeah, uh, I understand what you're going on about with um, the you still get free speech on Twitter, so you should harp home a little bit more about that. Oh, okay, okay. But when you when you pleaded guilty, you pled guilty to a cop car, not a DOC car. So that's wording on their end. Yeah, yes, up. yeah. So they fucked up. But, but uh, I think these guys think that I fucked up because of that. But I, I thought that was really good that it was different. But did did he understand it or did he not? I I know that you. What they did was they they put you into a trap, right? They put you into a trap that you played guilty on this. However, you played guilty to a cop car. You just didn't get to express that. So hammer that home in your closing. You played guilty to a cop car, which is referenced in the police report in the first line. It said you threw a cop car into the ocean. Okay. Not was... once did you tweet about a DOC car. You've hashtag cops. Oh, right? no. Yeah. Um, I think the water post had the DOC car in it. Mm -hmm. It definitely did. However, the police report, which is what they trapped you on when we you said Dean you down here, if we need was for food, a cop car. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that was another one, right? That was, that was a complete other case, right? It's the same case. So they've arrested. got the Twitter post in That's that fine. police report. No, However, the police report wordings of the police is you threw a cop car. Not, not so okay. you need to hammer that home know, hard. Is well, that like... you threw a cop car into the ocean, not a DOC car? You okay. have no ill will against the DOC. It's just the uh, your previous uh, grief was with the police. Right. Now, 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 freedom of speech is that like a, like an amendment or like something I can reference? Hey, your first hey, amendment right. First being freedom of speech. All right. So you just all you need to do is just keep hammering home that you sent a cop, cop car into the ocean. Not DOC, you yeah. have no ill will against the DOC. See, a little, Got it. Thing you need to know. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna keep bringing it up until they... I, I feel it like they understand it and we're moving on from that. Yes. So when you do your closing, you just want to do a whole little blurb about everything that's been yeah, brought up today. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just need you to talk question. about that police report because that's already been submitted oh, into yeah. evidence. So everything in there is evidence. Okay. So you just hammer home, no ill will against DOC, and that you pled guilty to a cop car, not a DOC car. Alright. Yep. It's a Hail Mary, but hey, we're gonna go for it. Alright. Yep. Go hard with it. Yep. I'm I am i am I'm gonna I'm a, i am I think I think if what's I stand you, tall and I admit guilt when, like you're free. And and I I uh, I look like, I like I'm uh, uh admitting to fault no. about the cop car or the cop thing. Yeah. As yeah, long as I separate yeah, that from the DOC thing, so I think they'll yes. they'll take that guilt and, and use it in my favor. So it's like I said, we're going for a Hail Mary here, but it's that's what I want you to do. No ill will against the DOC. And in right. your Twitter post, you did hashtag cops, not hashtag DOC. All right. what I just did. Yep, got it. Easy. Go hard, mate. Thanks, you're man. Doing, you're doing well. Yeah. I want everything to take and stick. Thanks. Yeah, scared pussy boy. Did you help him with the closing? Hey Molly, how you doing? Do uh, you know how much they're trying to turn? <laughs> Fuck them. We're having a good time over here. Got it. You can't identify what kind of car that is. No. Guys, you guys said I fucked up. They said I fucked up, but it's it's not like that. See, he understood, but they didn't. I admitted to the cop car. Not the, I. How did this fly over everybody's head? I did everything about the cop cars. I thought it'd be good that, that, I, that I do that. So they separate both DOC and cop. How did they use that against me? That's so weird. Alright, well, I'll make sure they didn't know this time. Well, they're entrapping me, but even their wording.
uh, they're, they said cop. If the judge is not smart enough to understand the difference, I mean, not, not doing his job enough to, to make the difference between cop and DOC in a DOC case, then just, I mean, what the fuck? So I'll make him understand then. Your Lada? Fuck my, 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 my suitcase. Lars Haverford? If I wanted to counter sue, right, based on how much time I spent here and lost in terms of income and lawyer fees and shit, I could, could I get de-damage for this? Where's my motherfucking time, dude? The yeah, lawyer fees, man. I had to hire this fucking absolute five head dude. Yeah, I, I pay him 1.2k per 10 minutes. I need, so I need my 10k now. Do this one then. Right, let's go ahead and uh, let's bring these closing statements in at this time. Uh, plaintiff, closing statement, please. Alrighty. Thank you, Your Honor, people of the court. You have heard testimony today of the defendant, Mr. Paul, admitting to have stolen government vehicles and driving them off the pier in order to gain street cred with the boys. A direct quote from the defendant himself. Nope, that is not what he happened. He was accused of these crimes in nope. police report 2298 mm -mm. and pled guilty to the crimes because, again, and I quote, he did them. The defendant has attempted to offer a storyline of self-manifested perjury in the fact that the defendant is stating that he did not perform these actions to steal a Department of Corrections vehicle, yet pled guilty when he was criminally accused and made no attempt to appeal these charges because, as he stated, he pled guilty. We ask, we ask that this court should not glorify such behavior by the defendant and should find him liable for the damages that he's committed. Sweet Accordingly, we ask for... this court to award the full damages sought, both to compensate the plaintiff for his out-of-pocket expenses and to discourage the further vandalism of government vehicles in any similar way by Mr. Paula or anyone else who would want to, air quotes, feed the Kraken. Thank you, Your Honor. Mr. Paul, your closing statement, please. Yes. Uh, I should have done an objection. Uh, uh, before before statement, can I say something about what you just said, or am I not allowed? No, it's already done. Fair enough. Fair enough. Closing statement. Closing statement, Your Honor, people, of the court. I have something very important to say uh, before um, before we close this up. First of all, I would like to state that the street cred that I was trying to gain. Uh, the, the methods that I used to gain those was by tweeting about an image that I found on the internet. I had no idea how it was taken in the first place. Not by dumping the cars like he said I did. Now, I believe in the First Amendment's right, freedom of speech. And I believe that I, I, I should not be found guilty of a crime for tweeting a joke or something funny on Twitter to gain some street cred. Now, he has stated that I have, I have dumped uh, a government's vehicles, cars in the ocean as evidence against me, but I have absolutely no ill will against the DOC. In fact, I have multiple friends in the DOC. They love me down there and uh, I, I even have uh, somebody, uh, 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 whatever. Um, my ill will is uh, against the police 
The police has done me wrong in the past, and I hold a little bit of a grudge against the police. So yes, I said I was guilty of dumping a police vehicle, cops, in the ocean. Now when this was stated by the plaintiff, they've said cops, when in fact they were talking about a DOC car. Now these are two different government branches, and I feel like they, these, the, the plaintiffs have manipulatively and intentionally confused both in order to, uh, to trap me uh, into uh, admitting guilt. But I admitted guilt about the cop car, not the DOC car. And the hashtag, let them know. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's about it. Yep, that's it, Your Honor. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Oh, Paul. You may fuck. return to your seat. Thank you. Uh, my notes were backwards. Uh, I'm going to go back and deliberate. I, I did delete and it, and it swapped. And, uh, I will return to you with a verdict very soon. Thank you, Your Honor. That was good. Uh, listen, you listen. forgot to mention the police report. Yeah, but listen, listen. The, the problem that is that uh, I wrote some notes when you told me about that, right? And um, mm. uh, I only had one piece of paper uh, on, my, on my thing, and uh, I I did a drawing, right? And uh, it mm. kind of went like a uh, over the writing, and, and I, I couldn't see at the bottom. Damn. Oh, you still did well. You did good. Yeah, look, so, look. I drew a cute dog. You see it? Did great. You did great. Uh, George, uh, George, your dog is here. Yeah, it's a nice little uh, is that a golden retriever. Yeah, nice little puppy. There, wait, where's there's a dog? Do you yeah. kill puppies? Nope. Did you know giving birth isn't as painful as being kicked in the nuts? Oh, oh, that. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, how about you get kicked in the nuts for 20 to 30 minutes straight consistently? No, did we all watch the same video? You Wait, you're saying just 20 minutes? Uh, have you ever uh, cracked your balls with your own heel? Like a high heel? Nope, your your own, your own heel, like like sitting down. I've done that before. I'll I'll line up to it. Mm. I've done that. I don't I don't think I have the equipment for that. Okay, now now doing RP, now oh. doing aerial projection. Uh, hey, you got bigger balls than most men in this city. Hmm. <laughs> 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 what was that laugh? Hmm. So oh, well, ominous with your sunglasses. Oh my God. Uh, is that me? the uh, the evidence yeah. uh, flashlight? Huh? Is that the evidence flashlight? Yeah, it's just a flashlight. Oh, I need to get a it's flashlight. flashlight. It's just a flashlight. I have for me a mask. Yeah, it highlights. I mean, you can see the ground really good with it. You know. I can see your pores up close. Ooh. Need to moisturize some more, but other than that. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking about the pores on my on my jacket. Y'all ever had a crepe? Yeah, of course, man. Yeah. They're, uh, they're so good. Of course, they're, they're... what about a hamburger crepe? No, nope. what? 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 Yeah, like those That's actually a thing that's have so like a good. Wait, hamburger what? with like oh. the donut. The donut is the bun. The Krispy Kreme. That's why Americans yeah. are fat. You have, right? that's they not, have the crepes. Like I would as, die the eating that. Yeah. Like a that's hamburger with a really side of diabetes. That's disgraceful. A hamburger. How is that disgraceful? What the hell, Reggie? What? I kind of want to hold it's, you in contempt just for saying those two words rap, together. It's literally a wrap, but it's a sweet wrap. Hey, That's brother, like you ever had a hamburger or crepe? <laughs> what do you mean? I'm Australian. Right. I don't even sound like that. <laughs> did, uh, did anyone fill out their bingo cards? Because I fell short by two. Oh, yeah, cool. yes, hold on. I, what are you, what are you missing? didn't get a bingo this time. Um, The witness is showing up late. It didn't happen. That's what I'm missing. Ooh. Yeah. You, you got it just by punched. the minute. Yep. I didn't. Nope. I didn't get that one either. I, I yeah. actually. Uh, I had to. Come here, Antigone. Yeah. No. For no, what? No. You can't force the bingo. I was almost I late I, because I, I, I. You might get. A however. You might. I needed somebody to get contempt. However. Somebody to be late. So how do you cross your hands? See, when we're not actively participating in court cases, we have a uh, a DOJ bingo card, and we mm. fill it in. That's how we entertain actually ourselves. actually put a stack of them over there for mm -hmm. people to pick up if they wanted to. Anybody has the ones I have right now is I don't recall. Objection that's not a real objection. Witness was clearly not prepped. Witness asked to repeat the question. Wrongly identifying someone. 
Judge bullies the witness. Now you got a sandwich? And wrong objection. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're actually asking Now, what I'm better. missing is witness is late and however in one row, and I would have had it. Yeah. I needed Artson to get yeah. stuck in something. With his wheelchair. Or the peanut gallery to be too loud, which was us, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah I needed... Yeah, we well, I mean, loud. you guys did get loud pretty... Oh, nah, not really. Yeah, but nobody yeah. shushed us, you yeah. know, no. that's the thing. Y'all were minimal compared to other peanut galleries we've dealt with. I mean, I heard people yeah. jumping off the railings last night. Yeah, oh that was annoying. And did then that really the happen? RC car. I have to practice. Yeah, yes, it did. I car. saw it, and I was pissed about it. I have to practice the hack. Getting blood stains on the damn carpet. You know how much it costs to keep this place clean? A lot. I don't have janitors anymore. So, as long as it doesn't take two hours to deliberate, like. Christ. Dude, nah, buck should happen. Yeah, it should be fine. Go back there. I don't think we can at this point. I don't think anyone asked to repeat any questions. Yeah, there was no asked and answered. That was actually pretty refreshing. Yeah. One, two, three, four. One, God, two, three, four. That. Also, no lawyers arguing with each other. Yeah. The same. One, two, four, three. One, two, four, three. That was pretty petty. Yeah. Could have done without that one. One, three, two, four. Oh, yeah. one, I three, feel two, like he was four. ready just to object, just to rattle, but then it would just be a waste of time. It worked. Three, two, four, one. Three, two, four, one. So how you think it's going to go? I'll tell Oh, Cooper just going back there. One, three, two, four. One, three, two, four. Guilty. It's not, I mean, it's, technically, it's he case. already pled guilty to everything that happened. Yeah, it's a civil two, case. One, he's four, not going to be found guilty. Two, yeah. one, it's four, three. Which is if the, he's going to pay money it. or not. The dice didn't say... No, they said... The dice said it. It's life. It's literally okay. said... It's, it's, it's got two sides to the dice. Guilty, not guilty. Two, three, three one, four. Two, three, one, four. I hate your dice. He was already guilty. I being overwhelmed. Oh, you think so? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Three, four, one, two. Three, four, one, two. You wanna go try to I can't I can't help him. No 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 no. One, two, happens. four, three. He okay. needs to have it on his One, own. two, four, three. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. The prosecution did try and uh, murky the waters with the use of police car all the time. Three I mean, one two four. Three car. one two four. We are officers. I mean, there's a difference between an officer and police, though. One, four, three, two. One, four, three, two. Peace officer? Sure. Yeah, true. Police officer? No. Yeah, I'm ready, I think. Corrections officer, yes. I I I'm fucking destroying this. Unfortunately, I need to go. No, okay. Yeah, no. I gotta go get a vaccine in the morning, so I gotta get some rest. Ooh, all right. have a good one. Good night, Dan, Dan. Good luck, yeah. man. See y'all there. Yeah, see y'all later. Y'all be good. Chat, I, that was, right. that was, I didn't know. I, I, My I'm fucking for this snapping is this. That you're going to be found liable, but you're going to have to pay like a thousand dollars, not the full 10k. Oh, okay. I think it's going to be ridiculous to pay the full 10k. Yeah. I mean, I think That's today I'm, I'm about to become rich and buy a car. Hell I mean, yeah. Mia. Yeah. Yep. For, for various reasons. Yep. Yeah. Okay. You were right with the dice, Reggie. Oh, job. Dice don't lie. So what'd you what'd you tell him over there? Well, uh, oh no, he told me about um a certain precisions about my uh, uh, final statements, and he brought something up about the the police report, and, and the police report says cop when it's actually DOC, and I mentioned that, but I didn't really mention the police Ooh. report, so that had nothing to reference with it, so uh, maybe it'll be overlooked. You know what though, something else I would have picked apart is hmm. the fact that they didn't actually get a receipt from Harmony; they've only just uh been shown a bank account statement. However. It doesn't show what was repaired in that. Ooh. It doesn't. That's exact. That's what I would have absolutely torn apart because then they can't just throw an invoice afterwards. Also, how do you know that the car that was repaired is the same car that's in the ocean? Mm -hmm. Could just be another Crown Vic. Belongs to DOC. Mm -hmm. Now that's exactly what I, I would mean. Have it's that really apart. hard with Crown Vics, especially with ours, because ours is like so white. We literally yeah. just have this like itty bitty dot on the side of it. Now, um. Madam, I'd like to let you know that uh, um, 
that that cry that I um wait, I can't. I don't want to incriminate myself. I mean, it's yeah. There's already, not good. You're fine. Yeah. It's been so yeah, long. It's a civil, it's a civil thing. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. No, you're fine. I didn't mean to. I didn't know it was a. It was a DOC car. I thought it was a cop car. Mm. Cause I like the DOC. But the you other... know, like cops, whenever the cars do get thrown in the ocean, tend to pay like two to three thousand dollars for the repair of that. Yep, that's the goal. Do you know how much an officer gets by the hour? Yes, six hundred and fifty dollars. It's what it's why I do targeted jobs. Like like yesterday, I I was found guilty of robbing a bank, and uh, the bank itself only had four thousand in it, which I split in half. That's two k. And they took 4K out of my hands. And uh, where does that money go? Where? Probably went to repair the car when I threw that bitch in the ocean afterwards, right? Now the scales are equalized and uh, the balance is now reset. I mean, it? I also think it goes to the state's debt too. Does it? What, the remember. bills for whenever oh, people get arrested? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah that yeah. goes to the state. I think we're almost like 3 million in debt now. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. Hold on. Oh, here we go. Oh. Out comes up. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna be guilty here, if, let's be honest. Well, let's go ahead and bring this court back into session. Uh, be rendering. God damn it. You okay, Your Honor? My phone's going off. Jesus. Okay. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna no, be found guilty that's what I was or saying. liable. Um, and have to pay like a thousand. In the case of Jack Friend versus John Paul, there's a couple of things that I want uh, to highlight as I give my verdict. Um, Mr. Paul. Okay. Um, when you were being questioned on direct, uh, do you understand that you did admit to the crimes or the report therein is true? Uh, and you pled guilty to the report there. And in that report, there is a picture reference as to a vehicle, a government vehicle, at the bottom of the goddamn ocean. Okay. Aww. Um. The, uh, also, sir, so uh, the, the the report indicates uh, cop when it's a DOC car. So. When uh, trying to feed multiple vehicles to the crack, and you do have multiple Grand Theft Autos on your record as well. Okay. But that wasn't brought up in court. And thus, so... that would show a propensity to steal cars no, and but... hurl them no. possibly into the ocean or just flat out steal cars, no. causing damages to them. Okay? Yeah, but well, um, was that brought up in court? I also, want, I also want this court to know that this is a civil case. Okay? Uh, in a civil case, all right, the burden of proof lies into a a um i believe a it's not a reasonable preponderance of evidence it's a preponderance of 51 percent probability you. Yeah, you, thank yeah, you yeah. thank you appreciate yeah, yeah. it thank you it is a preponderance of evidence that we decide on these cases in a civil court case in a criminal court case it is beyond a reasonable doubt so based on the preponderance of evidence that has been listed here today mr john paul you are going to be liable for the ten thousand dollars in damages that has been levied against you today, it's going to be payable immediately at the dismissal of this case. Okay, um, but yes, you will be held liable for the damages caused to the DOC vehicle that Jack Friend had to pay for, and the punitive damages therein. So the full amount will be awarded to the plaintiff at this time. Please be sure to pay the plaintiff um, immediately after this case. That being my verdict being rendered, please head over to the ATM and pay uh, Mr. Friend ASAP. Good answer. Thank you, Good answer. everyone, for coming out. Thank you for letting him know, Your Honor. Dismissed. Thank you, Your Honor. There's no way the repairs were 10k. That's bullshit. Uh, DA, fuck. Sorry. I gotta get my. I gotta get my. Uh, I gotta get my 250k rob bag robber now. It's time to go.
hand on me, I'll beat your ass. Ten K. <laughs> the sheriff car, sheriff car. Where's the DLC car? What the fuck is it? I mean, if he's, if he's gonna pay 10, if he's gonna have 10 give repairs, he's gonna pay 10 give repairs, not 2k. I want that money to go to repairs, not fucking entertainment, motherfucker. Why 10k anyway? Well, I don't have 10k, so I don't have the gun charge me. I don't know how they're gonna charge me. Uh, Konnichiwa, X9. What's up, pal? Uh, did you lose the court case? Yeah, I lost, but that's okay. Um, I, 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 don't, I don't even know what happened. I came, I came right at the tail end. Well, I, was, I got $250,000 that was waiting for me uh, out there, and I gotta go pick it up. That's why I kind of, I kind of threw the case. Oh, so I, so I, was going to get it. So I gotta go oh, pick it up. All right. Have you guys seen Jack? Yo, well, yo, well, yo, yo, where did I pay the fine? Uh, you pay it to uh, you pay it to Jack Frent. The problem is I don't know where Jack Frent went. I think his head may have popped. Uh, if you want to give it to me, I'll make sure it gets to him. I mean, I don't have the money, so what would I do? Uh, that would be up to Justice Stanton. If he wants to give you a timeline to pay it back, or Kevin, okay, I mean, you can just call me. Uh, Justice Stanton, did did you hear that conversation? I I, I got no, a word to get that money. What you mean you ain't got no money? Uh, yes, I was uh, I was charged um, for like like fifteen thousand dollars by the, the police. Jesus. Also, all my money is in assets right now. I have uh, eighty five thousand dollars in assets. Eighty what? I have eighty five thousand dollars in assets right now. That is the. Well, what what are those assets? Out. Better go cash. Can't talk about it. Assets. Assets. Okay. Uh, your Honor, in, in efforts of reclamation of assets that is, he is being court ordered to pay, can we subpoena all of his assets and figure uh, out what they I are? Have, I have 6k Shungite. 6k in Shungite. You want, you, want, you want my Shungite? You want it? No. You want it? You want it? You want my Shungite? No. No. And if you could get away from me, I'd appreciate it. Do I need to subpoena all of your assets to figure out where your money is? Ooh. Is it? Well, if you give me a ton to pay it... You'll get the money regardless. If you go to subpoena yeah, yeah, and go yeah. through the records, you're gonna waste your time because you'll you're not gonna find any any money any money. Is that right? Yeah. All right. So then, until such minutes. time as Mr. Paul pays, we'd like for our uh, you know Mr. Friend to be a judgment creditor against him. What does that mean? Right. Whenever it you make money, you owe it to Jack. Yeah, pretty much. Where's your money at right now? I mean, I believe that's private matter. Um, I, I, I mean, have the can, money. We can force it to be not private with a subpoena and force like a, all of your like assets a, into exposure like I said, if that's what you like. In, in, in any banks or um, property that you go through, you'll never find that amount. I have that amount. It's just somewhere else. Okay, so you're intentionally so, not paying the amount regardless of the fact that you own the assets. So that's violation of court order and potentially no, contempt of court by not obeying I'm the judge's saying, orders. I'm saying I did a service and somebody paid me. Uh, is paying me late. And I, I'm oh, waiting for the payments. Man. So when that when that payment kicks in, I can, I can, I can. You're twisting my words here, man. I like, I want to pay okay. him. I don't give a fuck. 
Seven, seven okay. K? Bitch, I make, I make like 100K a day. It's 10K. 10K. It's a big difference. Can't, while they're arguing, can I go, can we go to this? Well, all I care about is that my client getting paid. I don't, I don't really care uh, how that payment happens. He just needs to get paid. Bro, listen, the only reason why you guys won this is that I didn't make notes or whatever on it because it, it would be in best, in my business is just that it was a, it was a quick trial. Because I, I, can, I could have made that amount twice in that, that duration of time. Yo. Okay, whatever you have to say to keep yourself sleeping at night, that is absolutely fine. Okay, broke boy. I'm not broke, I don't think you understand.